You have to stand like a soldier but because we have a Lord that is protecting us. We have a God yeah. that is with us. We have a God yeah. that said, oh. we will never forsake us and not leave us. Oh, we have to stand firm. A believer, uh. what are you doing? Okay. A child of God. We call ourselves believers. Not just a believer, but those who have faith in Christ. What and Christ, scripture said, now, Christ overcame this word. You fuck again. But those who have faith in Christ. But what are we doing? And what are we doing? And what are we doing? And as a children of God, we don't know how to keep the vision. Oh, what we know is to ask something from God. We are not serious. We don't want to stand where. So where is your vision? Where is your vision? What vision did you, uh, that you have concerning Jesus? No. Hallelujah. Amen. Because your protector no. is the vision you have in Christ. No. Don't tell me that God can protect you. No. Or God is a protector. Once you don't understand the, the protection power of God. No. The reason why the protection power is limited no. in your life is because you don't understand or you don't have the revelation concerning the protection power of God. Everything. Hallelujah. Amen. Also, nowadays we are choking the house of God. Sabi. We don't want to be serious in the things of God. We want to submit what to the things of God. Christ has enough power to save us, enough power to secure us. Oh, well, but because of our inability to follow, we can't see the reality. Yeah, that yeah. is why the Bible said he told us, he said unto Abba, write the vision, keep the vision, for it shall surely come to pass. Yeah. Even when it tells, it shall never be ignored. It shall come to pass. The vision of God is meant for us to keep. But why, as believers, nowadays we have changed our mindset. All the revelation we have in Christ Jesus, yes, we are doing nothing. We are doing nothing to protect the vision. Always we allow, we allow anything stupid to come and blow the the vision out of your mouth. Can you believe a pastor which, which is preaching controversy ways than the true word of God? Even can you believe me more than the word of God? That is stupidity. That is why the churches and the children of God we can present will present Jesus well. We don't have to, we don't know how to keep the vision. Any little things when we encounter in our life, we give up our visions. We have a lot of people with the Lord meant them to introduce something special on this earth, but because of their lack of vision or the power to keep the vision, they allow the vision to be destroyed. God is going to change you because of your inability to keep the vision. Because the word of God says it is better not to hear than to hear and not to submit to it. Don't joke with the word of God. Are you doing as a child of God? What are you doing as a pastor? As a singer? Or a partaker in the things of God? What vision are you running with? We just came to church, but we don't come to do something. Ask yourself, what vision is my life accomplished? We just live anyhow. That is why money can cause us to submit our authority to God. And to the devil. We are joking because of the love of God. We take the authority of God for granted. We are not serious in the things of the of God. You are not the protector. 